Have you ever had a bad week? People you thought you were friends with are really bullies. My laundry smells like broccoli and I just feel bleh inside. So when I feel this way, I pray, I read my Bible, and I get creative with something and paint or bake or something of that nature. Today I'm going to be painting this miniature that I purchased from YZZ. It's a boat. As you can see, I, I think it's actually really cool. I can't wait to see it all put together, but before I assemble it, I am going to be painting it with some watercolors. It already has some really neat detail in, but I just want to kind of emphasize it with some colors. So I'm really looking forward to doing something creative and getting my mind off of those other things. There's nothing I can really do about those things except work on myself, find grace, and Work on this. I guess I could also do my laundry, but... Nah.
ready to start assembling. I uh, painted all the layers trying to emphasize where the light would shine on the ship. I made the top decks brighter and the lower decks more shadowy. So I don't know, like I, I could have put a lot more detail into them, but I kind of want to see what they look like um, as they are. So it looks like you start with this. This. these wedges to go into each into each of the support holdy things to hold it tight so wish me luck alright so that is the ship I feel very proud of myself. <laughs> I always feel proud of myself when I make these models because they are a little tricky. They're, they feel like a puzzle when you're doing them and then they look so cool. Um, I'm always worried I'm gonna break it. I don't wanna break it! But then when it just locks into place, it has such a satisfying feeling. <laughs> so I really love it. I hope we get to use it in a session soon. It's um, such a a neat piece. It really gives the table a centerpiece and um, it was a lot of fun to paint. Uh, now I, I feel like I, I kind of did a sloppy job. I really wanted to just add color to it, add some um, highlights and just give a little bit of detail just so it wasn't the, the natural um, pine color. So I like how it looked. I just wish it didn't match my table so darn well. Basically blends in. I think the trickiest part was putting in the tiny wedge pieces because they don't fit snugly. Um, in, some, in some spots they would fit very snug and then it would just stay in place. But a lot of them were very loose. So I'm going to glue them so it's a permanent fix. Uh, but for now what I did is I just wedged some paper into uh, the, the places that were a little loose so that it feels more snug. On the instructions they said that they did have a tutorial online for you to view which may be useful <laughs> if you get stuck like I was feeling stuck then um, it might be worth it to check that out because I really wasn't sure what I was doing when I first got started. Thanks so much for watching this video and I feel so much better. I feel very cheered. I feel relaxed. Thanks so much for watching along as I built this ship and I hope you guys are inspired. Have a great day and I'll see you in the next one. to do. Alright, there is a video tutorial. I should probably watch. I think 
I did it.